Exchange Online Allow Block and Quarantine List. With all the phones that are able to access your email service these days, it can seem like there's no way to control who is accessing your data or where they are putting it. This makes having a list of supported phones difficult and controlling the information on those devices next to impossible. To solve this challenge, Exchange Online provides access control to help you bring order to your mobile world while providing you an easy to use, easy to understand, low cost solution to this challenge. Exchange Online provides an allow, block, and quarantine list that lets you decide exactly what devices can connect to your email service. You can set broad rules such as which device you want to block and which phones you want to be able to connect. You can even choose to use advanced controls to place certain devices in a quarantine bubble while you decide if you want to let them connect or you can lock a particular phone to an individual user. With Exchange Online, you have an easy way to manage what phones are carrying around your organization's email, calendar appointments, and contacts. Managing the phones that access your email service is easy. Take a look. Simply log in as an administrator and go to the Options section. Select Manage My Organization and then select the Phone and Voice option. From here, you can see the Allow, Block, and Quarantine controls. We can create an organization that allows any Exchange ActiveSync enabled device to connect simply by selecting the Edit option and then the Allow Access option. Then just save and you're done. If you wanted to limit the number of supported devices, all you would have to do is select Block Access and save the settings. Then only devices that are approved are allowed. In this case, we'll also choose to quarantine unknown devices so we can see what is trying to connect to our email service and who is trying to connect the unknown device. We'll add a quick note that users should contact Bob if they have any questions. On a phone, the user experience will be transparent if the organization is open to all devices or if the user is using an approved device. If you are blocking the user's device, the device won't be able to connect at all and if you are quarantining the device, then the user will receive an email on their phone telling them that their device is currently in quarantine. With Exchange Online's Allow, Block, and Quarantine list, you have an easy and powerful way to control who and where your organization's information is going. Microsoft, your potential, our passion. For more information, visit us on the web at microsoft.com exchange.